Hi, it's Ilti Carlson here. Ron Keel is one of my favorite musicians of all time. The guy was a stand-up 80s rocker back in the day. He even played with a very young Eve Malmsteen and Steeler early in his career, and he reinvented himself later on as a country artist. And over the years, the guy's done just countless things, nearly all of which I'm a fan of. So several years back, I actually was able to get my hands on this. I actually bought this directly from Ron Keel. This is uh, Ron Keel, The Ultimate Video Collection. 20 videos, 1985 to 2005. I'm going to unbox this release and share my opinions. And this is just a standard def DVD. Ron Kill signed this for me when I bought it. Back's got the list of all the videos. Here's the disc. Got a nice looking Ron Kill logo on there. Kind of basic, but looks decent. And we actually get a pretty nice insert in here as well, which has that RK logo on the front. Back there has, you know, a printout of his signature. And it's got, you know, something giving the disclaimer that this is all from the best masters available. And then you have songwriting credits on the inside here. Yeah, like I said, Ron Kill's career has been all over the place. He's probably best known for his 80s band Kill, with which he recorded songs like The Right to Rock, and did the famous cover of Patti Smith's Because of the Night. But then he had a lot of other projects a lot of people don't know about. He reinvented himself in the early 90s as a country singer under the name Ronnie Lee Keel. He had a brief band that was him with several women called Fair Game. And then later on, he had a band called Iron Horse that sort of combined the rock and country elements. This collection covers a little bit of everything. We have music videos here starting with the Right to Rock music video back in the mid-80s up to 2005 with the song I Gave It All To You, which is credited to Keel and Wang. Now, like I said inside the booklet there on that insert, these are taken from the best masters available, and that's always a bit of a red flag when it comes to picture quality and things like that. The quality of these videos is very inconsistent. Some of them look like they were videotaped off a television onto a VHS tape. Others look like they were taken from slightly better sources, but in some ways, I think this sort of adds to the charm. One of the music videos even has an excerpt from an MTV giveaway contest with a chance to fly out to New York City and see Keel perform. So I love seeing moments like that. Again, don't come in here expecting picture-perfect quality or the best sound available. It probably is the best any of these will ever look, and that's a bit unfortunate. Now, unfortunately, another problem with this set is there's no play all button. So every time you watch a video, you have to go back to the menu and select the next one. And it doesn't help that the cursor resets to the first video after each one. So if this gets reissued, it really needs a play all button. If you're a fan of Ron Kill, this is certainly worth picking up. Just keep your expectations in check as far as the production values go. How about you? Are you a Ron Kill fan? What's your favorite band he ever played with? What's your favorite video in this set? Comment down below. And let me know what you think. Also, remember to subscribe to this channel for more context. I'm always posting new videos. And make sure you give us a like if you found it helpful. I'm T.O.T. Carlson. I'll see you next time.